Montana. Big Sky Country. The Treasure State. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. Ow. Who? Their leader. Joseph Seed. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Hey, Rookie. Rookie. You're wasting your time. There's no signal out here. I'm crossing over the hand bane now. Officially in Peggy country. How much longer? Just long enough for you to change your mind. So we can turn this bird around. You want me to ignore a federal warrant, Sheriff? No, sir. I want you to understand the reality of this situation. Joseph Seed, he's not a man to be fucked with. We've had run-ins with him before. They haven't always gone our way. Just sometimes. Sometimes it's best to leave well enough alone. Yeah, well, we have laws for a reason, Sheriff, and Joseph Seed's gonna learn that. Pratt, open a call with dispatch in for him. White Horse to dispatch, over. We're approaching the compound, Nancy. Over. Roger, Sheriff. Did you plan to go through with this? Over. We are. Unfortunately, still trying to talk some sense in our friend, the Marshal. Over. All right. Lucky I'm not there. If you get into any trouble, you just let me know. Over. 10-4, over or not. Maybe we should have brought Nancy along with us instead of the probie. These Peggies wouldn't fuck with her. Pratt. Why do you keep calling them Peggies? Project at Eden's Gate. P.E.G. Peggies is what the locals call them. You know, they started off harmless enough a few years back, but now they are armed to the teeth. Yeah, you know, they're looking for a fight. Are you scared, Sheriff? We're here. Compound's just below. <sighs> oh, my Jesus. This is a bad idea. Last chance, Marshal. We're going in. Set her down. All right, roger that. Dispatch, you still there? Yes, go ahead, Sheriff. You don't hear from us in 15 minutes. Send in everyone. Call the goddamn National Guard if you have to. Over. I'll be praying for you. Now listen up. Three rules. Stick close. Keep your guns in your holsters. And let me do the talk. You got it? Got it. Rookie! All right, everyone. Stay sharp. Let's go!
Be in the church. Stick close. What the fuck you doing? Follow the chair. Get up, Rookie. Get your head out of your ass and get up to the church. Christ, you're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much out here. They'll respect a nine millimeter. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet, Marshal. Can't you do whatever you like? What are you doing here? We don't want any of your business. <laughs> to get your name in the paper. You'll be fine. Something is coming. You can feel it, can you? We are creeping toward the edge. And there will be a reckoning. That is why we started the project. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us, take our guns, take our freedom, take our faith. We will not let them. Sheriff, sure, come on. Hold on we will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff. Sure, there not will be no more effect. suffering. Oh, fuck it. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. We knew this moment would come. We were prepared for it. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. I saw when the Lamb opened the first seal, and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. And behold, it was a white horse. And hell followed with him. Rookie, cuff this son of a bitch. God will not let you take me. on him. Sometimes the best thing to do is to walk away. I 
Let's go. Take point, we're going right. On it. Stay on the path, rookie. Dispatch? Oh my god. Everything is just fine here. No need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you.
Thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula, and then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard and we're gonna take out the rest of these. Okay. Shh.
You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. <laughs> Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation. Anybody? Anybody? Good. You found something that fits. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken, too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Be careful out there. It's crawling with pennies. Those fuckers are willing to die for that psychopath that's leading them. Now listen. 
Listen up. If you're gonna build a resistance, there's some things you need to know. There's four ways you can go about this. First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people. We might just fight alongside you if you help them. Second, you can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. Third, you can tackle resistance missions. There are a lot of folks out there waging their own war against this cult. And they could sure use your help. And last, if you're really looking for a fight, you can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. Liberating those places will give the Resistance solid footholds to push back against Eden's Gate. I've got cameras set up all over this island. I'll keep an eye out for anything useful. For now, head south and take out any culture you see. And help any folks in need, would you? Dutch out. You can't resist the Father's will for long! I guess this is what the project needs. Sinner! Needed. You better tell us what you know! These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. in the trees and the land, not some building.
the cold, grab a guy down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. Hey, this could be fun. Hey, deputy. Now that you're partnered up, the day you should head to the forest research station. Coast been crawling all over that place, using it as a depot for their goddamn bliss. Cult's been creeping around the island for weeks. Looks like they're trying to set up a base of operations at the old Keep ranger going. station.
Nothing like taking someone else's junk and turning it into something useful. My CB's on the fritz. I can't get a hold of anyone off this island. The radio tower near the south shore must be busted. You think you can take care of that for me? I should probably scrounge around for ammo later. Got your back, deputy. I 
know what you're thinking, and no. I ain't gonna have you climbing towers all over the county for me, so don't worry. Also, try not to fall from up there. Let's open up your map. I'll walk you through what I'm hearing. 